currently en route to go test drive and look at a minivan. A little background story. Prior to having Hunter, we had a, what, a sedan? We had a sedan and we decided we wanted something a little bigger. Unfortunately, at the time, minivans were not in our price range. Any ones that we were looking at in here that we found. So we opted for a smaller size SUV. Once Hunter was born, we quickly realized that it was too small. Once you have the stroller in the back seat, there's pretty much not a lot of room for much more. Also, it was a little pricier than we had wanted originally. We are huge fans of Dave Ramsey, and we know used is better. Live within your means. Um, but we decided to go a little bit out of our price range just because it was a great car, it was reliable, low mileage, all that. Is it like out of our means? Um, we determined it was, so we decided to sell the car, which we did yesterday. doors. Oh my gosh, there's so much space. All the seats. So much room for car seats. It's amazing. <gasps> what do you think? Do you like it? Yeah. the verdict so far what do you think it's a nice car it's uh it's fully loaded this is the nicest minivan that money can buy in 2011 so <laughs> we're only on. nine years behind but you know what that's what's in our budget i mean it's got power sunroof power doors everywhere it's got a giant tv this is 2011 technology so i mean we're going way back but just to show you, this one has heated seats. 2011 technology is no, that's, is that's that current we're at for us. Still. Uh, <laughs> that's state of the art for us. It's got a DVD player down there at the bottom, so you pop in whatever movie you want the kids to watch, and away you go. You don't have to listen to it. Plenty of crawl space for the toddler. Um, it has three-way climate control. And it's it's got a lot of stuff. Maybe. So we are leaving the dealership, and I'm gonna be honest. You know, this is I feel like the difference between him and me I'm more of a visual person he's more like all of he's visual plus mechanical and all that the interior which is what matters to me obviously I want a reliable car the interior wasn't as nice as the other one we saw I mean it has more features it has like that DVD player um, it's like the top line I think it's the XLE or something. It's the best one yeah. you can buy in 2011 
then of course, you know, we're doing this with two kids. He was going over the numbers, starts wheeling and dealing and lowballing. And I'm so awkward. I have to like walk away at that point because I just, I can't keep a straight face or like I feel bad. Like I'm like literally robbing them out of their own pockets. But he has no problem, no guilty, no Catholic guilt there. It's all here. I have enough for all of us. So anyway, so we obviously need to have a discussion. We're going to go. Probably check out the other van that we liked. I personally just thought it was nicer overall. I know it didn't have all the features, but like the interior I thought was like nicer and cleaner and it looked newer. So, <sighs> we'll have to see. Oh, there she is. Excuse the wind. It's super cold, super windy this morning. So, hopefully, you can hear me okay. After checking out the one yesterday, we decided that we just overall liked this one better. Um, Kyle kind of left the ball in my court. And I just, I don't know, I like this one. They gave us a really great deal on it. And yeah, we're super happy. So let's take a look inside. We went with the 2012. It's really nice. It's dark interior. Good. Everything is super nice. It's new to us. All this space, like I cannot believe we have so much space here. See if we can open the door. Look at that. With the touch of a button, doors are open. open how amazing is that but seriously it's freezing so I'm about to close everything back up Super excited about it. 